What's going on YouTube? I uh, want to make a video of uh, how to change your oil. The 2021 Tahoe. You know, 5.3. It's a two-wheel drive. Uh, I don't really care too much about the all-wheel drive or four-wheel drive here in Florida. So, uh, this is the oil that I picked up. There's not too much oil selections where I'm at. So, at least they did have this Zero W20 oil, full synthetic. Uh, got to make sure put a uh, recommended oil in there <clears throat> and uh, obviously they didn't have the filter I wanted either so um, I picked up this one here so it's also synthetic whatever it'll do the job so um, it's my first oil change on this truck I got about 17,000 miles and this is the easiest truck you can do an oil change on right because <clears throat> I just put them on those back ramps to try to level it because my driveway slants down. So I just want to try to keep it even. I'll show you why. So I don't even jack up nothing. You see that? I just put that on the ramp and lift up the back a little. So I got my little light right here. You're going to need a 15 millimeter socket. And let me get this light for y'all. And there it goes. Right there. So. It's gonna be a towards the driver's side, but the 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 nut is on the bottom of the bolt. Is at the bottom, like driver's side slant a little bit. So you want to try to have your vehicle level. <clears throat> um, you have it tilted back or forward. You're gonna have some oil sit in a pocket in there. So just try to get it as level as you can. Um, so you see I fit under here perfectly fine I've got, sorry about that I fit under here perfectly fine so um, no need to jack anything up obviously make sure you got your wheels chalked and if you do jack it up put your jack stands where they go uh, that's all on your manual in your car so um, see if I get a better view but it's pretty much everything is right there. The filter is right next to it. The filter is right next to it right there. So it's e pretty much easy access. So um, I know that bolt uh, goes tight and down to what, what, 20 foot pound, if I'm not mistaken. Um, if you don't have a 15, I think you can do, I think it's a T40, don't get me, don't quote me on that. I think it's like about a T40, so. If you don't got a 15, you could do a torch. Um, and that's pretty much it, guys. Like, there's nothing to it, man. Get yourself a nice big pan. Don't get yourself a little pan. Um, because it will overflow. Um, so yeah, just let that drain up for a couple minutes. You know, just take the, the cap out from the top. Which is over here. Um... So I don't know exactly the recommended course. I haven't checked that yet. So, um, but you know, I would put this whole thing in first, measure it, and then add a quart or half a quart at a time. Just not, you don't want to overfill it. So make sure your car is parked on a level surface. And yeah, check it a few times while you're just putting oil a little bit at a time and you should be good. So I uh, hope this helps anybody out. Uh, thanks for watching.